Also, I just realized this outfit kind of makes me look like a door. They're squishy. <laughs> okay, I'm done with myself. Ah, uh, sleeping in is so nice. But then, aren't there days when you wake up late and realize you have to be somewhere, but there's no time to go on Pinterest to look up cute outfit ideas, so you run to your closet and start throwing clothes everywhere because even though you have so many clothes, you still don't know what to wear because... That's happened to me way more times than I would like to remember. Five minutes later, your room looks like a hot mess, but you still don't have an outfit picked out yet, and you don't know what to do because now you have to clean this hot mess and pick an outfit. Well, I'm here to help you today. I'm going to give you guys 20 outfit ideas. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today, I'm going to be giving you guys 20... That's not 20. I still don't know how to do this thing. Outfit ideas. 20 spring outfit ideas to wear once this quarantine is over and we can finally go outside. I live in the northeast, so it's still cold during springtime. It's like 40s, 50s. If we really get lucky, like maybe it'll hit 70s. This haul is like kind of warmer clothing. It's not really shorts and a t-shirt just yet because that's more late spring. So it's going to be a lot of sweatshirts, long pants, and stuff like that. But first, I have... A mini, really small Shein haul. I ordered this stuff last month. It came in recently, but I waited to film this video to open it and everything. So first, I got this shirt that I've been seeing. Really trendy shirt recently. The material is not bad. I don't remember how much this was, but I'm pretty sure it was pretty cheap. You just tie it in the front and it has the flowy sleeves. I think it was cute and I've been seeing a lot of TikTok people, TikTok girls wear it. So, I decided to um, get one. And this shirt is going to be included in this outfit video. Next two items is necklaces. So, I've been really liking that whole layered necklace trend. I don't even know if it's a trend anymore. Adding a couple necklaces onto a basic sweatpants and hoodie outfit really changes the entire outfit. I got this one. What is happening? And it's like three necklaces, but it's really in just one necklace. And I really like this. I think it's cute to wear over uh, just a basic hoodie or crew neck or even t-shirt. This one is a longer layered necklace. So this, oh my goodness, it's all tangled. Yeah, when they shipped it, there's like these little marks on here, but it wasn't even attached on the mark. It was just like a pile. In the, anyway. So this necklace, it's kind of tangled right now, but obviously when I put it on, I'm going to untangle it. So... There's a pendant thingy. The last two things I bought are bikinis. Obviously, I'm not going to be showing this at all because this is a family channel. So I'm going to insert a picture of what they look like on the side. I'll try them on off camera and then tell you guys if I like it. So the first one is this leopard one. And it's a triangle bikini. The bottoms are tie and they're high-waisted. So, verdict after trying on. Um, these are not that secure. So if you're going to go in the ocean and like go boogie boarding or chill in the waves, this will probably slide up. The bottoms, I really like the bottoms. They're pretty secure and they fit me well. This is a size size small the material honestly is not that bad considering this was pretty cheap really cute for pictures so if you're gonna tan this is good for tanning not so much as doing activities like running jumping and going in waves would not recommend you'll probably flash someone all right next bikini i got this black one also in a small and this one is more like a bandeau top so it's like this and you just tie it in the back and there is wiring and padding in here and then these are the bottoms and right now it's untied so for this this one, I really like the bottoms, fit really nicely, and the materials, not that bad. I think this one was also along the lines of $10, but the top is kind of weird. I don't really like the top because it's kind of flat, like there's cute for pictures, not really that secure for going into the waves and stuff like that. Between the two bikinis, the leopard one looks more like the picture than this one. The top for this one, as shown in the picture, it looks more like soft, like fabric. Yeah, it just looks a lot more soft and flexible, but this is not really flexible. There's a wire. All right, guys, so that concludes up my mini Shein haul. So let's jump right into the outfits. Outfit number one is on. So I have this flannel from American Eagle. White crop top that I don't know where this is from. If you have a white crop top, I'm pretty sure you can get like a really basic one at H&M for like two bucks. This is H&M men's sweatpants. And then I have a pair of enemies on. 
This is a more casual, chilly night kind of outfit. Obviously, I told you guys I live in the Northeast, so it gets pretty cold. This is like springtime weather. You cannot wear this in the winter. All right, for this outfit, we have this long sleeve button up. This has also been in trend recently. I've seen a lot of clothes like this. I actually, this shirt was given to me, and it was actually a long button up sweater. So I sewed it to make it a v-neck, and then I only buttoned one button because that's the trend right now. I paired it with these pair of mom jeans. This is the Shein necklace, the longer layered Shein necklace, and I paired it with a pair of black booties. Honestly, I probably wouldn't wear it with the black booties because it feels too professional. Yeah, this is outfit number two. Kind of classy. I don't know. Third outfit, the Shein shirt that I was showing you guys. I actually like the sleeves a lot, and it fits me really well. I'm pretty sure I got the size in an extra small. And then the Shein necklace. These jeans are from... These are Paxson jeans, black ripped denim, and then I'm wearing a pair of Vans. Alright, outfit number four, button-up floral shirt I got at Paxson. These jeans are from Forever 21. I'm not wearing shoes on, but I would probably wear this outfit with Vans that I just showed you guys, or a pair of boots. Underneath, I'm wearing this tank top from Brandy Melville. This is more of a casual, chill day. Next outfit. <laughs> this is outfit number five, I think. This tank top, white tank top, kind of flowy shirt thingy. These pants it's actually a set so these pants from american eagle they're stretchy pants and then i'm wearing a pair of sandals that i got from payless shoes this is like a really flowy a really nice spring day go on a picnic date in this just for fun i tried on the top with the bottom this is the matching set that i got from american eagle a couple years ago so i don't know if it's still there Outfit number six. Oh, I'm out of breath from changing. When you work out every day, but you still get tired from changing clothes. So these jeans, I thrifted. This top, American Eagle. And then these boots are also from American Eagle. I don't remember what outfit number this is, but this is a more girly, really girly outfit. This shirt I got from Boohoo. This top I got from... Pretty sure this top is from H&M. I don't really remember. But it's a plain black long sleeve top. I'm pretty sure you can find that anywhere. And I'm wearing a pair of sandals that I got from... Pretty sure it's also H&M. Try to be a tap dancer, like... Anyway, alright, so this outfit makes me feel really girly. I've seen this trend a lot where people layer a dress on top of a t-shirt, and it's actually pretty cute. It makes me feel like I'm going on a picnic date. This shirt is from H&M, basic white t-shirt, you can get it anywhere. This dress is from Forever 21. I'm wearing these yellow sandals. They're from... I'm pretty sure the yellow sandals are also from H&M. Right, so I'm not sure what number outfit this is because I got 10, but also I have no idea. I can't count. It has these cool designs on the sides. This is the back. This I got for over 21. These pants, they're really flowy. They kind of cinch at the bottom. Oh yeah, I'm wearing the H&M sandals again. But these pants I got in Maine at like a little booth. This fair kind of thing. So since these are kind of in trend, I'm pretty sure you can find anywhere. This is not spring outfit for up here. But you guys live in a warmer area, obviously. This would be really cute. Casual with a little bit of edge. I'm wearing this Forever 21 crop top, black crop top. These pants are from Hollister. And I'm wearing my American Eagle boots again. Alright, so this outfit is more casual, comfy, lounging day kind of thing. These are guy shorts from guy shorts of H&M. This jumper is from Forever 21. It's a Justin Bieber one. It says purpose on the back. And I'm wearing a pair of Conkers. This outfit I really like because it's neutral color and you can't go wrong with that. These biker shorts are from Fashion Nova. They're really thick. They're really good quality. And also, I went biking with them. They're called biker shorts and I went biking with them. This crew neck thing is from Zoomies, I believe. And then I'm wearing my tan Hirachis. Hirachis. I don't know. Hirachis. This outfit, excuse the shirt, it's wrinkly because um, it was folded in my drawer. Vape shirt, got from Stock X. It's really big. I think this is like an extra large or something like that. These are my Nike Swish pants. I posted a picture on these and I said that I thrifted them and I did thrift them for $14. $14 for Nike Swish pants. These are my pants. Yeah, well, they're my pants, but they're like my favorite pants. They're squishy. Anyway, this outfit with the chain, obviously. And I'm wearing them with my legend blues but the icy blue bottoms have faded and now they're legend yellows all right so this is the same outfit just different shirt and different shoes this shirt says 40s and shorties in colors you guys can see that 
Um, let's get the chain on. This shirt is from Zoomies, I believe. Yeah. My Nike Swish pants, and then I'm wearing a pair of. I'm wearing a pair of 11s, lows. These 11s still have the icy blue bottoms. 40s and shorties. I feel like even though this is a more formal dress, I wore this to my homecoming. It's spring, can't go wrong with a floral dress like this, and it's light, you know, going cute, lunch date. This dress is from Francesca's, that really expensive store. So I'm back now. I was stupid and didn't realize that I only had 14 outfits and I was missing a whole 6 outfits. So now I'm back and now that the sun has set, I'm sorry for the bad lighting. I know it's kind of yellow. I'm trying my best. I got this sweater at H&M. These pants are also from H&M and these shoes are also from H&M. So outfit number whichever, I don't even know. Right, next outfit. Oversized t-shirt. Got this from Forever 21 in the men's section. And then biker shorts. I got these from Boohoo, I'm pretty sure. You can't really go wrong with biker shorts and the oversized t-shirts and then I'm wearing my nines my bare nines I have white socks pulled up a little bit because I just think the look is cute especially when you're wearing shorts I don't know I kind of like the chunky kind of look but <laughs> okay I'm done with myself this is outfit three two I don't four I don't even know two top from forever 21 or H&M I don't know biker shorts same ones as last time I'm wearing my 11s lows and the chunky sock and this jacket I got at Paxon a couple years ago so I don't know if it's still in stock. This outfit would go perfectly fine with this dress denim jacket. Jacket? This dress denim jacket or any denim jacket or any jacket in general. I just like this one because it's a little more chunky. Also I just realized this outfit kind of makes me look like a door. This is the last outfit with biker shorts, I promise. But once again, biker shorts. Then I have this windbreaker that I got from Forever 21 I'm pretty sure. Then I have my Balenciaga triple S's with the chunky sock again because can't wear sneakers without a chunky sock even though I probably did in the beginning of this video. I don't know, I think it looks pretty cool. Second to last outfit. So this is a more girly like summer vibe. These jeans from H&M. Um, I rolled them up a little bit. Also, I'm not wearing shoes for this outfit because I probably wear Vans with this. This top I got from Paxson. Yeah, I just think it's a cute girly outfit because that's what I'm trying to be now, a girl. That's outfit, it's a more comfortable, chill outfit. This top is from Old Navy and it actually, I have sweatpants for it too and it's white and fluffy and it's so cute. These shorts are from H&M and then if I were to wear shoes, which I'm not, I would probably wear a pair of slides because this is a chill outfit and slides are pretty chill. Yeah, okay, that's it. <laughs> That concludes this video, and I hope you guys enjoyed this video, even though some of the outfits might not be springy wherever you live. If you guys got some inspiration out of this video to make your own outfits, then like this video up, maybe subscribe. I hope you guys have a great day, and I'll see you guys on Tuesday.